What is up everyone? Welcome back to Chrono Cross, the Radical Dreamers edition for the PC. So we got Surge back. And we got Glenn in the party. And we're going to get the second Iron Lancer in this episode. So let's take the boat. We have to go to another world, I think. Just double check real quick here. Yep. Let's switch worlds. I go through the cutscene with Surge though. It's not automatic like it was of Lynx. But you can just skip it. So it's not a big deal. Alright, we'll just run over here then. To Termina. You are... Gosh, I was really surprised to hear about what happened to you. Although you might have some hard times. Don't give up. I'll be rooting for you. Oh yeah, I'm closing up shop today, so go ahead and take any uh, leftovers that'll cheer you up. You've received some Bipachuros. They taste better than usual. You feel revitalized. There was something hard inside it. We found a rainbow shell. Alright. Cool. Yeah, make sure to talk to him and get that rainbow shell. That was the reason why I, that's the reason why I talked to him, is to get that. Anyway, if we come over here... See here with Glenn, you have to have Glenn in your party. Fine Lancer is resonating. Brother, yes, I understand. The sword I will take into my hands, and together we will fulfill our unfinished dream. Oh, yeah, dual wielding time. Glenn has inherited the Iron Lancer, number two. You get the first one dry earlier on in the game. Alright, now that that's out of the way, um... Not sure if there's anything else we can do here or not, but I think we can go to Marbule now and um, buy the better hammer for Zappa. I'm not sure if it's another world or home world though. I just have to find out real quick. If it's not this world, I'll switch over. I think it's actually the other world. Yep, it's the other world. Okay, so I'll switch over and I'll be right back. I'm gonna head, head to the Opasa Beach and switch over. And then I'll come back here. Alright, I'm here in the home world of Marbule. And there's people here now, as you can tell. Look at this place. This place is bustling. But if we come over here... Hey, you're an adventure, right? Well, you're in luck. I'll sell you my handcrafted master hammer for only 10,000 cheap. Eh? Yes, definitely buy it. Like, this is the best purchase you'll ever make in this game. For sure. Much obliged. We can talk to some people around here, too. Hey, it's Toma again. Yo, how's it going, kid? It sure feels good to be working together towards a common goal. It's about time for me to settle down instead of going on these bogus expeditions, or I mean, audacious expeditions. Honey. Oh, he's got a... Here's your tea. He's got a girlfriend or wife or whatever. Um, thanks. And she's a mermaid. Ha 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 ha. You caught me in an embarrassing situation. Honey, is he a friend of yours? Oh uh, yeah, I guess so. This is Surge. <clears throat> nice to meet you. I'm Toma's wife. <clears throat> Aha! Ha 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 ha! Oh man, it's embarrassing. Well now, you know, things happen. 
It's not embarrassing at all. Nothing wrong with that at all. Well, now you know. Things happen. Oh, yeah, hey. I used to have this, but I want you to have it now. Lord received the quill and papyrus flame, or er, frame. <laughs> she doesn't have much to say. <laughs> this dude's name is Ash. He must be from Stranger of Paradise, guys. Maybe I'll just settle down here and have a quiet life to any dating services here. He, what happened was, guys, this dude named Ash, right? He left Chrono Cross and then later went to Cornelia and joined the Stranger Paradise game. True story. Obviously, I'm kidding. Hey, it's Fargo. Arr. You were great that time, matey. Oh, yes. I remember that one. I remember when you... Oh, yeah. Har har har. Hee hee hee. That time when you went to and... Got enough already. You promised you wouldn't tell anyone. Har har har. Heat. Those two are finally getting along. That's good. Good for them. Oh yeah. I never knew work could be so satisfying to the body and soul. Hey ho. What a great idea of work. Great idea to work together towards a common goal. Yeah, throw you into the water. Throw you in the water too, buddy. Sorry guys, if you're new new to this channel, I like to throw I like to throw NPCs in the water. Or say I do that anyway. Can't actually do it though, unfortunately. I wish I could. La la la. Never been so happy in my life. La 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 la. So everybody's all happy here now. They were all all like upset earlier on in the game. Oh, what a lucky guy, that stud muffin. This suppose is going to be fabulous. Oh, feels like love is in the air. Okay, you can come up here. I don't see the point though. I don't like there's anything up here. Woohoo, I like this place. I'm making this my home. But it's a bit too dark. Let's see. I'll make this a sunroof and lighten it up. Then we can all live ha here happily. Okay. This village is going to be... Okay, I already, I already read the talk to that person. Let's go in here and see what's going on in this place. Luckiest guy in the world. Ain't that right, honey? Yes. <laughs> Everybody's dating mermaids around here. Can't talk to the mermaid, though. Pirate dating a mermaid. Bro in G-Shop. Hello, welcome to G-Shop. Okay. Let's see, any new traps or anything? It doesn't look like there's anything new here. As long as I have one of every one of them, I don't really care. I do like diminish though. I think I want to buy some diminishes for those are really good. I don't really like uh, this one right here because it also amplifies the damage that your opponent does too. 
So it's very risky to use that one. But I do like Diminish. Diminish is really good. Oh, nice to meet you. I'm the doctor assistant. Or, I'd, or so I'd like to think. One of these days I'll prove myself worthy. Doctor is a great man. He took a look at my cat just a second ago and now it's completely healed. Watch out for the assistant guy though. He tried to give me the wrong medication. So not only is he a doctor, but he's also a veterinarian too because he took care of the dude's cat. I'm glad this room was left as is. Hello, nice to meet you. I'm the doctor's assistant. Oh, okay, same thing. Never mind. Welcome to Marbule, the village I filled with love and happiness. Alright, so now we can put Zappa in the party. I don't know if he needs Zappa in the party or not, but I'll go ahead and put him in there anyway. Real quick, and we'll... Start making the rainbow stuff. Well, obviously I'm not going to be able to make too many of them at the moment, but... I will eventually be able to. But... I guess we could make some in this episode. We do have a couple rainbow shells. Um, so I guess I could. We can get a third one as well. I think I went, to, I went to the wrong world. We're supposed to go to the other world. I'm going to go ahead and switch worlds and I'll be right back. Alright, I went and switched worlds as you can tell. Let's go ahead and enter the place here and go back here it'd be a wee bit hard by myself but the two of us working together it should be a breeze sounds interesting good timing just finished an order let's see what I can do all right so this is the rainbow axe. Mm, it's probably creating such beautiful colors because of its prismatic nature. The response from the hammer is as satisfying as it's finished. It would be truly an amazing material. We should be able to do this on our next on on next time. It sure was a brilliant job. I hope I can work with you again. Zappa learned how. I'm not sure what happened to my audio. It's weird. I don't hear anything in the game. Okay, it's fixed now. Okay, there we go. So it was just... It was just no audio at that point. I thought I, I thought my headsets went out or something. Alright, but anyway... Now we can make prism stuff. And these are... Ridiculously powerful. Um... They're the best equipment in the game that you can get. But you only want to get them for characters that you plan to use throughout the rest of the game. So... And because there's only a limited amount of them in the game, there's 19 rainbow shells that you can get. Everything else you can get infinite of. But the rainbow shells, only 19. So it's impossible to make a rainbow equipment for it, every one of your characters. So for me, I'm gonna make a rainbow sword for Fargo. And what was my other character? I got Sir. Oh yeah, Glenn. No, Glenn has the Iron Lancer, so he doesn't need the rainbow. Um. So I need a sword for Fargo, basically. Is all I really need. I have 51 to the door right now. Wow, that's crazy. Alright, anyway, how do I... Oh yeah, Spectral Sword. This is what I need. Um, as you can tell, I got 41 Shiny Dew, which is insane. Uh... 
to get the other ones all you gotta do is here I'll show you so you get shiny do by summoning the frog prince by defeating enemies with a frog prince right so now what you want what you want to do let me show you very easy like this is a ridiculously easy to get um let me switch my party to get my party back together here. That we won't Fargo in there. Fargo is really good. You could do Karsh instead of Fargo, but Fargo's more tanky. Um and has more accuracy. Only just slightly less strength as well. Um I just want to use Fargo because Fargo can also steal too. Um, but yeah, let's go to the bend of time. So we don't need any more um, shiny dews. I got plenty of shiny dews. So. What I want to do. Is work on have one character equip one element so let's do that um, oh that's right they can only equip whatever their type is that's right so we're going to, have to do multiple different types of people wait what happened to my okay there we go Sonja there we go And I'll equip Genie too, whatever, it doesn't matter. Um And I don't need to have him in here right now because he already I've already got like I said, I've already got plenty of uh shiny deuce, so I don't need Fargo right now. I'm actually gonna switch Fargo out for another type. I need a character of a different type. That's not water or wind or light. Or wind or light, I mean. And water, of course, because I got plenty of water. So I guess I'll bring her in there. That's fine. Doesn't matter. Literally doesn't matter who you use. You just need to equip the elements. Alright, now what you need after that is buffs. You need like... Uh, we need support. We need like. Let's see here. Let me find some. Yeah, like imbecile, like genius stuff like that. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. We want them in slot one too. That make makes it easier to cast them. I should honestly buy more of these because I'm running low on them, obviously. So I should buy more geniuses and all that stuff. And I got plenty of wind stuff, so. Let's see here, we'll put some eagle eyes on there. We're gonna need those. Okay, and we're gonna need light elemental stuff too because for Surge to be able to boost his light field because you got you have to change the field is what you gotta understand so that's why I'm equipping these buffs because they help very well at changing the field and you can just put them in slot one too so and 
anti-black. It's fine. Oop. Didn't mean to do that. There we go. So now what we want to do is go to the bend of time. I'm not sure what world. Uh, I'm not sure if it's another world or home world. I think I might be, I think I might actually be in the right world. I think it's this battle right here. It might be the b another battle. It might be. It. Okay, it's not that. It must be this battle. No. Nope. It's the other world then. Let's go to the other world then. It might be home world. Okay, that's the maybe. It, wait. Hmm, I'm confused. Confused why I wasn't able to battle there. Let's go to the boat. Let's try this this bend up time over here. I think I was in the right world, though. Okay, here we go. So this is a battle against the... Nope, this ain't it. Not the right world. Three HP for Glenn. Maybe it's this battle here. Okay, this isn't the right battle either, but I think this might be the right slot. I think it changes every time, right? Yep, here we go. So this is the battle against the four mannequins. This is the one you want right here. So now what you want to do is not miss attacks, first thing. You want to change the element. Now the problem is I don't have any other geniuses on my other characters, so I'm just going to have the other characters defend. And want to just spam genius here. Until the field becomes all black. Then we want to turn on the booster. Okay. So the booster will give us access to all of our elements. And we don't have to worry about building it up. And then we can cast Mothership. Uh, I guess... Um, I guess I should use Genius on herself. Just to make sure she's able to kill him. I'm not sure if she's strong enough to kill him is the problem. Alright, now I'll do it. She actually has to kill the enemies with it. And then you'll get four of whatever type you use. Oh, oh yeah, that's more than enough, yeah. And so now watch this. Watch what we get. Four shiny suits. There you go. See? Now you just do this over and over again. Until you get the right battle. You want the battle against the mannequins. I'll just keep the battle boosters on. It doesn't matter. I don't think it's worth it doing the other battles. I think it's only only the mannequins. There's also these uh, red chicks as well that you can do it against too. Okay. So I guess I didn't. Re oh wait. Oh, I forgot to save it. Or no, I don't. No, we're good. Never mind. I'm stupid. We're good. I'm. Was thinking I. 
couldn't use mothership, but that's right, I can't use it because <laughs> we need to have the field full. So right now what I'm doing is I'm just building up the element, filling it up here. And now what I'm going to do is cast it, cast Mothership here again. And that's pretty much all I need, like, I won't need any more of that element. I won't need any more shiny suits. Well, maybe not anyway. But now we got to do it for Glenn. And, uh, Surge. I already gave him... I think I have to use this one, though, for Surge. And I could use Sanja. Alright. Yeah, let's just go. There's a save point too if you need to save it. Yeah, I might as well speed it up here. So you can just do that. Then you can go back over here. Okay, there's four enemies in this battle too, so I can do it in this battle too. Doesn't really matter what battle you do it in. Well, actually, it, it kind of does because... Because the, gr oh, the Gremlins will use wind attacks, so we can just tap Glenn. I'll do Eagle Eye here. And we should have no problem building up the wind typing here. I can just do heal all, even though. Okay. Do another heal all here. Okay, and then we'll go over to Glenn. And we'll do Genie. We should be good here. Assuming it defeats them all, which I'm sure it will. Yep. And we'll get four of the win one now. Shiny Leafs. Yep. Save it. You don't have to save it every time though, but... I don't think it matters what world you're in either. I, I, I'm not sure why I switched worlds. I hit it before and it didn't like it didn't work on the other world. But it shouldn't matter, I don't think. Okay. Now fighting these things are a little bit annoying. You gotta wait through their text and all that stuff. And they also are good at changing the elements too, which is bad. Because you don't want them to change the elements. So you can't really do it against these things really. Because I'll be constantly changing the elemental stuff. Um, I guess I could do it though because like the wind getting pretty intense already. Yep, there we go. And let's do Genie. And we'll get if we do, if this defeats them, we'll get four more. Now you need four of every single one of these. So 
All right, so we got enough shiny leaves now. Now we need to get some light elemental ones. Oh, with Surge. So I need Surge to start. Okay, here, here we go. Here's the battle. Now you don't want to use offensive attacks, obviously. That'd be stupid. You want to either recover or use, like, this stuff. But you should have elements on every on every character to help with that. I don't actually have it right now. But to make it easier, put light elements on all your characters. Or whatever type you're going for. If you're going for fire, put fire on all your characters. And don't worry about these mannequins, all they do is counterattack. Oh crap, I almost ran. Okay. Now we'll do Saints. We're gonna attack the enemy and then heal the allies. This is pretty OP. But that does require like a full field, so it's really hard to do, so don't rely on that. Shiny salts. It only works on those mannequins because the mannequins don't change the field. So that's really the only reason this works is because of the mannequins. Because the mannequins don't change the field, like I said. And you can just defeat the other enemies if you want to. You don't have to... You still get money and everything, so. You could put a Profiteer's per Purse in this area, too. That way you can amplify uh, how much money you get. Now for this battle, I don't think I'm going to be able to, um... I think I'll just Luminaire and defeat these things, because I don't think I'm going to be able to, uh... Oh, well, that didn't kill him. Sonic Sword. Only works on a single enemy, though. Yeah, it's just, it's too much. Like, I wouldn't be able to fill up the element enough. Unless I had light on all my characters, which I do, do not at the moment. I think I will give the other character some light stuff, just to help out. Okay, let's try it again here. Okay, I could, I could probably do it in this battle. I gave my character some, uh light stuff we'll see how it goes maybe I won't be able to it depends because all I had was purifies don't use any wind attacks crap Dang it, come on now. This is why you want level 1 stuff though. And that way you don't you lose too much stamina and you can still do stuff. I need to cast one more though, but they're probably going to use a wind attack here. Which is going to break it up, unfortunately. Hopefully not, we'll see. 
Okay, we're good. Do saints. And we'll have enough light elemental items. Uh, I already have enough water, so we need wind and... Or no, we need earth and uh, fire items. Alright, so we'll do... We'll put an earth character in there. Earth and fire I need. Okay. There we go. It doesn't matter which earth and fire characters you use, just... As long as they have a level 7 slot. They need a level 7 slot, obviously. So you have to make sure they have a level 7 slot. Okay, and nothing in supplemental. Now, good for me, I do have plenty of uh, fire and earth ones. I hate how it like goes to four every time, even though I want to put it on the one slot. It's kind of annoying when it does that. Okay, that's good. Now we give some earth stuff to him as well. It doesn't really matter what earth stuff you give them, it's just better to put it on slot one. Because that way you lose, you lose less stamina. So that's good right there. Okay, I gave, I gave Surge some elements too, so he'll be able to help out too. Alright, we're good to go. We just need to find the mannequins. And not duckies. We don't care about duckies. Being able to have a frying pan. Three HP for Norris. Okay, I should probably. I could probably do it in this battle too. It's fine. They don't usually like, they have to attack sometimes, so. And they also have elements that'll help us sometimes too, like fireball. We'll help with the fire one. Yeah, see? But the wind one kind of hurts us. But we'll be fine. We should be able to do it. I'm going to focus on fire here. for this particular battle. So as long as what's his face gets a turn after this, we should be good. Assuming he is thing can kill him, of course, too. Yep, there we go, we're good. Red Wolf. Nice. Took them all out and we get shiny embers. All right, cool. And you can farm more than eight. We're gonna need more than eight eventually, but I'm just gonna get eight for now. And then I'll work on the other, I'll get some more later, you know? I don't need to go full ham right now on it. Okay, here's some more mannequins. This is, this is literally the battle that you want right here. This is the perfect battle here. 
Because they literally won't do anything. So this is like, it's literally perfect. Hey, you know what? Let's go again, Surge. Okay, and then we'll do Red Wolf here. Hopefully finish them all off. Yep, there we go. The Minikins are pretty weak too, so they can easily be killed. And there we go, four shiny embers. Go back over here. And we just rinse and repeat. Now we do it for the earth one. And then I'll switch my main party back as soon as... Um, Alright, here we go. Now we want to do earth stuff. Oh, I, don't, I, I thought I gave him earth stuff. I guess I didn't. It's fine though. We'll just do it with Surge. Yeah, they basically have like the mime effect that uh in like Final Fantasy or whatever. Which actually just helped me out because Alright, there we go. Now we'll do Golem here. He just stomps on him. Flattens him like a pancake. That's probably the weakest one of them all. Okay. And we'll do one more battle. It's the mannequins and that'll be it. We'll be done. Well, either the mannequins or the one chicks as well. Yep, here we go. We'll actually use them to help us out here. Watch this. We'll do low res and hope they counterattack here. They don't always counterattack, obviously. I'd be kind of overpowered if they if they counterattack every time. It'd be overpowered. So I can see why they didn't make them where they counterattack every time. Because if you use like an offensive spell on them and they counterattack with it, that could be really bad. Let's say you use like a volcano on them, right? And they don't die. And they all forecast volcano. That would be bad. You wouldn't want that to happen, obviously. And there we go. We have enough shiny elements now. And we're good to head back to, uh... And that's how you get shiny stuff. I'm not sure if I need to be in the... Other terminal or this one. I don't think it... Does it matter? I think it does matter, don't it? I think I have to be in the other world, I bet. We'll see. Cause I don't think there's a blacksmith here, right? Yeah. So 
So unfortunately, I do have to go to the other world. Dang it. All right, I'll meet you in the other world, and I'll be right back. All right, here we go. And let's start making some stuff here. So let's see here. Fargo. Yeah, Spectral Sword. Yeah, we definitely want to make one of those. Um... Yep. And then... You can also make Prism Mail, too. However, I only have one more, um... Rainbow Shell. You can also make Prism Helmet, too. It's the best helmet. But we need to get more Rainbow Shells. Let's check out that rainbow shell, shall we? Or the prism uh, plate or whatever. Prism mail. Yeah, pretty big upgrade there as you can tell. And we'll be able to get one of those for each of the characters eventually, but for now we can't. Because we don't have enough rainbow shells, but we can give the spectral sword to uh, Fargo. This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to put Fargo in the party right now. I'm also going to put Glenn back in the party too. No, not her. There we go. Turn off those buffs now. And the Spectral Sword. Yeah, five point attack increase and also uh, one to accuracy as well. Alright guys, that'll be it for this episode. Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for the next episode. And later.